the street, in the water, or at the track. If you drive it, we can fuel it. And it's going to be Jack Beckman for the fourth time. Check has been signed over to Jack Fast Jack's wife for the hundred thousand dollars. Jack, you've been here before. Your fourth Traxxas win. What impact is this going to have for the team? Well, we're all going to get some bonus money. I'll tell you that. And I want to give a shout out to Robert and their team. They did great. He was driving away from me, and then uh, and then I saw his car disappear. And you never say never. They had the better car today, no question. We kept the fight. We popped the windshield. But for Traxxas, for the X Max, we're going to go play with our toys and put it online. And some lucky fans going to win if they check our postings on our Traxxas cars. I am so excited. This deal has been amazing to us. Something tells me replacing that windshield is not going to be a problem. Congratulations. Yeah, we can find more windshields. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Nice. Obviously, the conditions were completely different from, you know, running those 360s like that. And our first run today, we spun the tires, but believe it or not, Grubby didn't back up for the last run. And were we low ET at that session? Yeah, yeah. We were. So this is a, a, a crew chief that just smoked the tires and he didn't back up. He pushed forward. Yeah, you know, I mean, obviously it's a pretty warm day, um, both sessions, and um, the cars going down the racetrack. You know, we've had uh, real success um, as far as in the cool and also in the heat with this new uh, new pipe that we have. So uh, pretty excited about that. You know, it's yes, a uh, huge race. Um. You know, the first round today wasn't too bad. It wasn't far off of last night, and, and we were able to run, you know, pretty good within a couple hundreds of what we did last night. But we knew this afternoon with the sun on the track all day long, going to be very, very similar to what we're going to see tomorrow. And in fact, even hotter yet tomorrow, but definitely a big step towards what we're going to see tomorrow. So made a lot of changes to the race car and uh, it responded perfectly. Well, I think that's that's the key there. Like you said, seeing different race conditions as this weekend's gone on, we've had drastically different weather each day. Friday was killer, insane, cool at you know 70 degrees and nighttime run and then same thing on uh on saturday night as well as saturday afternoon but here we are sunday you know simulating sort of first second round in between our runs there and uh